Now, uh, there are, of course, a lot of people who are reaching out to them. Citizens are reaching out to help the migrant laborer population, several initiatives in that direction being taken. So let's, in fact, uh, talk about specific cases. Let's uh, get updates from the national capital first. Delhi government has ordered state-run schools to be turned into shelter homes. This to accommodate those migrant laborers who, for fear or, uh, of their landlords, have left their places since they will not be able to pay their rents. Now, they have been asked to move to these shelter homes that have been created out of government schools. They will be provided with food over there in these uh, shelter homes. So my colleague Alok Singh joins us from one such location in Ghazipur. Alok, if you are there with us, first of all, uh, what are the ground realities at this moment when the government says that these government uh, the run schools, state run schools will operate as relief camps, as shelter homes on ground? What is it like? How many people in this particular place where you are at and what are the facilities provided to them? Well, Afrida, good morning to you. And in fact, everyone uh, is affected uh, because of uh, this lockdown. And the worst affected are the migrant laborers and workers. In fact, I am standing outside one of the schools. Uh, this is uh, which now turned uh, to be a Rand Basera, uh, which is which is shelter home. रहने और खाने का इंतजाम दिल्ली सरकार द्वारा जिला मजिस्ट्रेट पूर्व जिला दिल्ली सर्वोदय पूर्व जिला दिल्ली सर्वोदय कन्या विद्यालय सो इन गाजीपुर सो दिस इज द प्लेस वेयर राइट नाउ स्टैंडिंग दिस इज द स्कूल्स मेन गेट एंड हियर एट लीस्ट ट्वेंटी क्लास रूम्स विच आर नाउ टर्न इन टू द शेल्टर होम मेक शिफ्ट शेल्टर होम्स एंड इन दीज क्लास रूम्स द पीपल आर स्लीपिंग we went inside also and we saw that the people are sleep sleeping uh, in fact uh, uh, when we talked to them some of them also complained uh, that they were not getting tea uh, today morning but uh, soon after they were complaining just just a few minutes later that the tea also came so this way that all these things are happening yesterday remember afrida uh, there was uh, uh, the complete lockdown announced by the central government after they saw that no social distancing was being followed by these migrant workers who were boarding the bus from Anand Vihar. Where right now I'm standing, this place is half a kilometer away from the Anand Vihar bus terminal. And we, we saw the day before yesterday the, what kind of social distancing was being in fact uh, 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 that, that the people were doing a social distancing or not because the people were trying to stuff in the bus and to just wanted to go back to their resident. Yesterday also the same thing happened. But later after that in the evening when the central government announced that no movement of any kind of of uh, people who are migrant workers, they will also be not allowed to move from now onwards. So definitely many got stuck. Till yesterday, this shelter home was very much vacant. But today it is completely filled up. 20 rooms are there inside this uh, uh, this class, this uh, this uh, school. And all these classrooms are now filled with the uh, uh, with these uh, uh, migrant workers, women, children, all are staying there. And uh, uh, definitely uh, there are classrooms. So uh, in the classrooms, they are sleeping in the bedding. Separate beddings are also there. Uh, uh, so uh, there are, uh, so there is uh, the social distancing that the uh, government has tried to maintain uh, but people are sleeping inside uh, so this all these things are happening uh, we hope that whatever the measures that the Delhi government is taking uh, definitely that it will help in mm -hmm. preventing the spread of coronavirus further back to you